What was that for? What was that for? Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Welcome to Circuit de Barcelona, Catalonia for a Porsche Cup race on iRacing. Now, I did this last week when I failed miserably in the All-Stars and I'm doing it again. I'm going to try and get good in the cup car. But I think I've figured out what my issue is. I was running the brake bias too far back. I've actually increased the brake bias in this race from 42.5 to 43, 43.5. And it's much better. So I think I was just putting the brake bias too far back and locking up the rear diff. So for this one, we've qualified. P10 with a 1 minute 45.090. We did get an off track on our second flying lap, and that was a 44.6. That would have been good enough for P6. Now, in this race, you're going to see what I'm calling a glitch, and I'm going to report it to iRacing, but it essentially ruined my race, as you saw by the intro. So for this race, we're using the Acertec Forte wheelbase. You might be able to see the Invicta wheelbase just down there. I've actually put the Acertec Forte wheelbase on, which is an 18 Newton meter wheelbase that I'm testing, and I'll do a video on that in the next week or so. But early impressions are super good, like really, really good. But before we get into the video, if you do like it at any point, please remember, click on the like button. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. So 15 laps around Barcelona with a glitch. Let's get on track. Right, I'm nervous for this one. I'm not gonna lie. I really am. I don't know why, starting P10, probably that's why. Probably because I'm starting right in the middle of a Porsche Cup race. Not really where you wanna be. But we'll do the best we can. We'll try and keep it clean. Try and keep it safe. We need the safety rating. Shout out to Michael, who's to my left. Or, he will be. He said hello before the race, so hello, Michael. Hope you have a good race. Tenth position. The track temp Here we go. Is 26. The air temp is 20. Celsius. Okay, Dave. Get ready. For it. Green, green, green. <laughs> that guy got a flyer. Oh, there's carnage behind. Oh, jeez. Holy moly. Car right. On your right. Clear right. Your stuff's okay. Car on your right. That must have had a slowdown. Right, let's calm down a little bit. Let's just calm down. Come on, boys. Let's, let's just relax. There's no need to be so excited. Don't any pesky off tracks there. Oh, it's all kicking off the front as well, look. Somebody's off. I've never, I don't think I've ever raced this layout. I don't think I have. I quite like it though. Oh, that's enough track. We'll take it, we'll take it. Oh, four wide. Briefly. This doesn't look good, does it? Still 
Probably I'm not talking much. Still in it. The minute. Oh, put the delt on. Put the wiper. Man, this is a tough combo, this. I don't like them textures either. I wish I racing would fix those. And the ones that were Atlanta, at the bottom of the hill. Come on, David. I'll try third here. Nah, it's probably about the same to be honest. I know the Delta says otherwise, but... Oh! Not a hiatus. We almost stopped there. Wow, that's mental. That's mental. I'll try. From there, so slippy. Good thing is, though, it really is easy to make a mistake here in these cars. Really easy. Third gear, maybe. Actually, they're too wide action up ahead. I like it. Don't like sliding like that, though. Just waiting a little bit too long there to get back on the gas. Okay. I've never been able to miss that sausage curb at Barcelona. You know, you see people straddling it. I've never ever been able to get that line right through there. 
and straddle that sausage curb. You said. Spicy up ahead here, you know. Right, this guy's starting to defend already. Oh, another off track. Dang it. Where are we going to go? That way. That was always going to happen, I think, though. Oh, I've got that all wrong. I really don't want to start defending from Christoph behind this early. There's a top five could be on here. Size up there. Not good. Back one click on the brake, boys. We're losing these, we need to get our head down here. through that. We're we'll slow lap though. Need to turn in later. I think that's what my issue is. Need to turn in later for turn one. It needs to get a bit scrappy again. I don't know how much you can cut that. I wasn't doing that in qualifying, in practice. <sighs> right, turn in later, turn one, Dave. Just 
Yeah, that's a bit better. Just needed to open up that left. Much slow though. People are going to be pushing on though towards the end of the race. I'm just over halfway now. No, 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 you absolute off track. Why are these guys in front though? Like absolutely flying. See that guy in front straddled the curb then. Stop sliding. Oh, 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 where am I going here? Can I get it back? Just about. They've gone a lot wider into there than I am. And they're pulling away, so I should really start doing that. They're like, going a lot deeper than cutting it back for a, a fiddle ace apex. Instead of having like, instead of it being a double apex, just treating it as one apex, but really lace. Oh my god, rocking them up here! Can't see my breaking marker there now, the sun's gone in. I'll try, Jim. Right, let's try and break a little bit deeper. Just got to watch for that guy behind, sneaking in there. That's the only thing.
Right, pace has dropped right off now though. I'm holding this lot up. Thankfully the sun's back out on this lap so I can see my braking mark over that down to the left. Just like a little tyre mark in the middle. Oh, was that an off track? It wasn't. Well, it was, but it shouldn't have been. What was that for? What? What was that for? Did I miss a slowdown or something? What, what penalty is it? It doesn't even tell me on the screen. It doesn't say what it is. What? I'm confused. I don't, I'm, I don't understand, I'm literally... Uh, unless my UI is not visible or something, I don't, I don't know what's going on. That's a shame. Where's the pit entrance? There it is. Right. Do I have to stop? Is it a drive through? Stop and go? I presume it's just stop and go. Oh my god. I, I really didn't see. Why? Now I can't see for the chuffing you uh, the race labs. Look how big it is. Right, I'm going to study that when I finish this. Let's see what I did wrong. Have I just totally missed the slowdown? Can't see the friggin' apex.
literally can't see it. Oh, this is Michael up ahead, who started next to us on the grid, who said hello before the race. I'll just say that I slowed down and pitted just to let him catch up so he could be in the video. Think you buy it? It must have been something to do with that turn, it must have been. Two more laps. I can't believe that. P15, two laps left. P15. I can't believe I've missed the penalty or whatever it was. Oh, goodbye, my friend. Thank you. Might be able to if we could see the uh, apexes on the left hand side, Jim. Literally can't see. It's a good little race that one. I enjoyed that up until that mystery penalty. Probably not a mystery either, to be honest. Just me being a thick idiot. Last lap. Let's just hope something happens on the last lap. So, we're not even going to gain safety rating on this. Annoyingly. Gonna be a mistake, or it's gonna need a mistake from the guy in front anyway. Wish to do anything here. What an idiot I am. You'd think after being being on iRacing for six years that I'd stop doing shit like that, wouldn't you? Or making mistakes like that. I enjoyed the race though, good race. I don't mind losing iRacing and safety rating. Okay, well I do. Over. But it's not as bad when you've had a good race. Which that was. I enjoyed it. Right, let's have a look at the carnage, shall we? It was a bit chaotic down into turn number one, wasn't it? There was somebody who didn't get away at all. A guy. Thankfully we survived. Did he survive? 
No, I didn't. He certainly didn't survive. <laughs> Sorry, that's not funny. Mr. Eatwell, what's he going to do? Nothing. Oh, that was the guy in front of us. Easy done. Nice paint, though. Nice paint. Uh-oh. There's Glenda Marie. Uh oh, what's going to happen here? Oh, dear me. I've got a bit quiet. Need some carnage. He's having a nightmare, that guy, isn't he? Oh, so is he. Almost a 50-50. Oh, we skipped forward too quickly there. This car's already a bit uh, worse for wear, isn't it? Try the cup car, they said. It'd be fun, they said. These are just going to be curbs. We don't want curbs, we want carnage. And I haven't featured at all, right? Which makes you wonder why I got that penalty. But after these incidents, I'm gonna jump into the car in a test session or a practice session. And I'm gonna try and get a slowdown to see if it appears on the screen. I'll show you that as soon as these incidents are finished. Glenda Marie got the win there. I bet he didn't want to do that. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I thought I was going to hit him. Will they finish now? I think that's it. Mr. Edwards is doing some donuts. Well, Mr. Edwards, finish what you're doing, son. Well, let's just see what he's doing. I mean. Mr. Edwards, what are you doing? And that's it. That's it finished. Right, let's see if we can actually get a slowdown. Let's see if it does show up on screen. Because it didn't. I watched the footage back. It didn't show up on screen. So this is a practice server for the same series. So over here you should do it. We were robbed? What if it's some kind of glitch? Like a random penalty, just like, because the race director didn't like my glasses. Annoying. Right, let's have a look at the results, though. Right, so there were 
four splits for this one. This was the top split. The strength of field was 3,357. Look at that. We lost 0.51 safety rating. And because of glitchy muck glitch face, we lost 23 I rating. So Jorn got the win. Michael P2 and Julian P3. We finished all the way down here in P14. Car number six started P10. Eight incident points. Not good enough. So who was the biggest winner? Well, it looks like it's going to be Zhao. Is that how you pronounce it? Zhao, who finished P4. He gained 67. And the biggest loser is going to be Bruno. He lost 137. So, there we go, P14. It could have been so much better if it wasn't for that glitch. I am calling it a glitch. We went back on track, as you saw, in a practice session for the series. Cut the first corner, got a slowdown. It was visible on screen. I didn't get any other slowdowns in that race. And my penalties, well, they were up to about eight incident points or something at the time. So, there's no reason at all we should have gotten a penalty. And essentially, that ruined our race. So I think I figured out my problem, though, with the Porsche Cup car running the brake bias too far back. I don't know why I was doing that. I really don't know why I was doing that. So we're going to move it forward for the remainder of the All-Star Series. And hopefully we can be a bit more competitive. We can't be any less competitive, can we? So if you did like the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. As always, thanks for watching. Have a good week. See you later. Cheers.